Welcome, welcome. Thank you, family and friends, for joining me. And what else? Maria loves to talk. And yes, you guys, I am talking about fragrances, perfume, and I'm here to help you just in time for Valentine's Day. That's right, to help you pick out those little get. Well, you know what? I can tell you some nice colognes, sexy colognes to get your man, to get Sugar Pop, or get Big Daddy, get, I don't know, Sugar Bear. But hey, I don't have any samples, but I will share with you. It's you girls, do not wait at the last minute, okay? Do not wait. This is the perfect time to go and get your honey bun, wife, I don't know, girlfriend, boyfriend, husband, fiance. Uh, you know what? Let's not leave out mama, big mama, godmother, uh, your aunt. Uh, maybe the first lady at church, someone that helped you. I don't know, maybe the bus, school bus driver or something. But yeah, you guys, we went to Sephora yesterday. Macy's having a big sale, 25, 20% off, off the fragrances. I went to Burlington and Ross this morning. Everything was already picked over. It really wasn't a, a large selection. You know, I don't know, maybe they still trying to put things out. Um, the fragrances I'm doing today will be a little mix and match. I've got a lot of stuff from Bath and Body that I picked up a little over a week ago. And then I've got some things that will be honorable mentions, ideas, and just a mix and match. And then I ordered some YSL fragrances that came in. It took like two days. And what I like about it, they gave me some samples. I love those samples. Uh, ordered some things from a company called Small Flower and then from... Sephora and I'm just I will tell you about it later I'm just kind of uh, getting upset with these places where they're not uh, giving quarter samples even if you buy things uh, they're not giving anything they're real stingy and you know what I, I figured what I'm, I assume that's going on they are saving their little samples that's right their little quarter samples when I say quarter samples I mean this and they're putting their little their little loot. That's right. <laughs> On uh, eBay, uh, Poshmark, uh, Macari, wherever, because they're surely not giving it to to the customers. They're not giving it to us. Okay. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video because I have four videos, four different perfume videos to give to do to share with you guys to help you make those decisions yes right so i will start off oh my gosh let me i'm confused i'm gonna start off with this one here this is sweet cinnamon pumpkin i know y'all like maria what are you giving us sweet pumpkin christmas thanksgiving over with but hey you guys i got this really cheap it was like two weeks of foaming hand soap my gosh, where's my receipt to show you? Because I don't buy it unless it's on sale. Let's see. It smells like pumpkin. This was when the, it was just like two, exactly two weeks ago. Like, or not quite two weeks. It's not overly pumpkin. It's just right. I think this was like 175 or two something. Duh. And I also picked up on the, and I, we love the little hand sanitizer because I give everybody one of them. I think it's like five, what is it? Five for $8 or five for $10. And it goes in your purse. If you even have a little small purse, I like to put it in my blue jeans. Okay, so here, this is called Carried Away. Just in time. Carried Away. Carried Away cruise ship, carried away to Poconos, carried away to the beach, carried away, I don't know, off the dance floor or on the dance floor. Okay, this is raspberries, nectar, jasmine, and whipped cream. Whipped cream? You guys, my mind. Whipped vanilla. Okay, let's pray. I already know it's good. And I already have one of my little nieces begging to get this. Mm, yes, it is. You will be carried. You will be carried away. You and Big Pop on that cruise. <laughs> yes. 
carried away. I don't know. Uh, honeymoon suite. I don't know. Okay, so move on next one because I got a lot to go, you guys. Uh, we already know Cotton Candy Clouds. They're probably trying to copy Ariana Grande. Cotton Candy. If it's Cotton Candy Clouds. Okay, Clouds. Okay, so that's why it's blue. I just wonder why it wasn't it pink. So this is uh sun, this is spun sugar, pink berries, and of course whipped vanilla. This one is good. I, but but y'all already know I love sweet. <laughs> I love sweet stuff. I, I I can't help myself. This one is a five, five and a half. Five and a half, you guys. Moving on to my next one. This is called Golden Sunflower. A couple of years ago, we planted, I planted like a whole row uh, of sunflowers. And the sunflowers, they were in different size. And I had some huge ones. And the only thing with that, it attract bees and stuff. So here, this is sunflower petals, orange flower, and fresh vanilla. Is that right? Yeah, fresh vanilla. Okay, so let's see. And I sprayed it. And again, everywhere you go, this is from when we went to Sephora. They want you to spray it on a card. You can't do anything with a card. And I thought it was just me. But I've been reading comments from uh, perfume, uh, P Divas, perfume, uh, Grand uh, Dudes. I have a name for the guys that do the, the cologne. Okay, the perfume, Grand Grand, I don't know. I don't know what to call the dudes, but I'll just say grand dudes, perfumers. And everybody's complaining about the same thing. This this one's good. This one smells fresh, but it smells it's not that sweet. I would give this one a three and a half. This is a three and a half. Again, back to the cars. Everybody is saying the same thing. They cannot do anything with these cards. The cards do not last. There's no smell. Then when they use the card and then they go back out and they buy a full bottle of whatever, it could be Tom Ford, it could be Carolina Herrera, it does not agree with them or it's not the same thing that they smell on the card. Okay, so this is called Prismatic Stars. I think this one, what's this? Let me know. Was this during the, from the holidays? Prismatic Stars. This is Raspberry Stardust, Mystic Plum, Cosmic Cashmere. Mm. And I love that purple, that magenta. Mm -hmm. And I'm smelling the plum. So if you are a plum person or purple rain, yeah, a purple rain person, this is for you. I would give this one, I would give it a four, a four, maybe four minus. Uh, you know me, I'm just keeping it real. It's not sweet enough, but it, it's good. My next one, Jingham Fresh. Jingham Fresh. And the young lady uh, at Bath & Body recommended this to, to me. Because I'm kind of trying to get away from all that sweet, sweet, sweet. So this one here is Juicy Pear. Fresh daisies, juicy pear, and clementine. I wonder if it, did I smell it? Or did my niece smell this one? Let's see. It's good. It is fresh, but it's it's got like a little tad sweetness. It's crisp. This is just right. This to me is office getting, um, out of the uh this is gonna be your office office uh you just finished work out at the gym you're in a hurry to go pick up the kids you're going to the post office um these others this plum to me that could be date night uh the what i said the cotton candy date night uh, beachy as well as carried away date night that can you can also probably get away with it uh, office as well and this one here um, this would be like office everyday fragrance maybe even also when you get out of the gym 
of course, I don't know, hopefully you showered. I've heard a lot of stories about people going to the gym, going to Planet Fitness, going to uh, Gold Gyms. What's the other one? 24-hour fitness, whatnot, blah, blah, blah. And do not take a uh, rinse off real fast because, you know, when you have that all that sweat and stuff, the bacteria causes all that back acne and whatnot and other other issues. So these are going to be my honorable mention because I have some fragrance, fragrances to test out. And I will tell you some of the things happened to me at the store. Okay, so this is Burberry. I almost forgot I had you guys. I'm not, I'm not bragging or anything because I didn't even know I had that many fragrances. I got really about 1,500 fragrances. I was trying to uh, organize because I have a lot of these. I ain't going to lie, y'all. I know I got about 500 of these little small ones. So I was trying to organize them in some kind of way. So I'm organizing these little small ones I'm, I ordered from Lucky Scent, Perfume Core, Scent Split, whatnot. I'm putting them in either the name, the first name of the designer or the name of the fragrance. And it's hard. I'm still organizing. Okay, so getting back to this, I would recommend this, Burberry Her. Watch my video. I have a video on that one. That one's good. Uh, this other one here is Burn Honeysuckle. Very good. That's a yes. And you know, you know, I love Victor Roth flower bomb. I love it. I love it. I love it. And this is Ruby Orchid. Guess what I was doing, you guys? I was over there uh, at Sephora. I grabbed some... Do I smell anything? I was grabbing these and spraying. Yes, that's what, that's what your girl was doing instead of using the card because I can't smell nothing from a card. I got these from uh, Macy's yesterday, Dolce, Gabbana, Givenchy, um, Good Girl Blush. I mean, all these. One of the ladies was so nice. She gave us like four, four of these cards. The Gucci, Gucci Guilty Elixir. You guys, if you got the money, because right, I ain't going to sit up here and play with y'all, you got to get it. It's $175. I told my niece, I, I'm going to wait for your birthday. Your birthday's in July. I'll, I'll get it for you then. If not, hopefully they will have the travel size, you guys. So the next one here is Victoria's Secret Tees. Honorable mention. Watch my video. And my next, last one, Vanilla Solar notes, solar notes, honorable mention, and they are good. But getting back to the lady at Macy's, um, we looked at what she gave us. It was like four, four, four of these. So my niece, she gave her the Gucci Elixir. She gave her the Tiffany, Tiffany Gold something. And then she gave me... Chloe something, and I forgot what the other one, but make a long story short, you guys, right there, if you bought it on eBay, those are like $10, and the Gucci Guilty, the Gucci, yeah, the Guilty Elixir, it's not even out. Uh, I, no, I take it back. I saw some people selling their little card for like $12. So the four that she gave us, that that basically was $40 worth of stuff she gave us. And we did not buy anything. Went on, I'm going to keep it real, went to um, Victor Roth uh, table. Uh, the lady uh, didn't have any samples. She was giving me a card to spray. And I can tell she got offended because I had my little wig on and I was just spraying my wig. Yes, with that Tiger Lily. That Tiger Lily Victor Roth is so good. So let me stop it yep and give you some, share with you my fragrances. Then we went on to Carolina Herrera's table. Again, this is all at Macy's. Nobody had any samples. Everybody give me these cards. And right now, I can't smell anything. By the time we walked out of the store and into the food court, 
It was couldn't smell anything. Okay, so here y'all, I'm, I'm gonna just share here with in this video. Hopefully you've made it to the end and I'll share again when I do my second video or maybe my fourth. This is how I kind of like cheated or, or did my own thing. <laughs> My niece was like, please don't do this to me again, Annie. You embarrass me. I'm like, I don't give a care. I'm getting my sample today. So this, you guys, is my version. Well, I'm going to go ahead and spray it because, like I said, I didn't know. Remember, I shared with y'all, do not be ashamed to get your samples or, I don't know, order it from eBay or buy the travel discovery kit from Lucky Scent. But I have bought these. I put this tape on it because I'll share with you the hack that I did when I went to the store. But I bought a whole box, a whole box of these for like, I don't even think it was $10 from Amazon. It's like 50 of them. So while we was at the store, I said, you know what? I'm going to use my Sephora. Oh, talking about Sephora. You guys, I went to Sephora. I think, was it my sister? I don't know. Well, we went, I think it was Thursday or that Friday. And the lady was like, oh, we, we don't get samples anymore. And I was like, wait a minute. Let me show you my receipt on my thing. Because I just spent $175 with you guys online. So you tell me you don't have no samples whatsoever to give me. Oh, no, man, we don't have. I said, what about the carded sample? Oh, no, man, we don't have any. We stopped giving samples away three years ago. I'm like, three years ago, I mean, I know I just went in to the Sephora Inside Coles last month and the lady gave me two samples, two card samples. And then today I went, again, you guys, uh, the guy uh, gave me this. This is Mark Jacobs Perfect. Okay, I'm going to put it here. But she said, oh, no, we don't give samples, and we're not inside JCP. I didn't know, you guys, there wasn't inside JCP anymore. But, yeah, they don't, Sephora don't give any samples. So, basically, and believe me, they are getting these corded things. These girls in these Sephora's, Macy's, Dealers, wherever, they're getting these. That's why they are on eBay selling these for $10 to $15. And I saw some Tom Ford and another fragrance was a Mademoiselle. People were selling the card as much as $20. Okay, so this is a Victor Roth Ruby. And I'm gonna spray it in the air. I already know what it smells like. Yum, yum. <laughs> Valentine's all the way. And this is a, a 10. To me, anything by Victor Roth is a 10. I'm gonna try. Taylor Swift, Wonderstruck. Now, y'all know, if you don't know, I know you are a, a Taylor a Swift Ultimate fan. You know uh, that her fragrance, our go-to fragrance, is Tom Ford Santel Blush. And I know y'all should know that. I should have put that as a test, as a little quiz for y'all. Okay, so let's see what this one, um, her fragrance, and this was a sample and this is called Enchanted. I picked this one up from Fragrance Net. I like it. And I did a video on this one. I would give Enchanted, I would give it a, a four, you guys. I would give it a four. I don't know, let's be honest. I mean, can I be honest? It doesn't smell like Tom Ford, Santel Blush, because I have that. Okay, moving on to our next one, Michael Kors. I love, love, love Michael Kors. This is um, Sparkling Blush. Nice, pretty, little light pink. This is definitely, if not Valentine's, this is a definitely, uh, yes, Mother's Day gift. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, of course, Michael Kors is just like a Tom Ford to me. This is a 10. This is a 10. Moving on to my next. And this is Dolce. Is this? 
Dolce Rosa, Dolce Rosa, and this is a pretty pink. And I picked this one up. I don't know how did I got eBay. I got it off of eBay. Um, it's gonna be a while before I order anything from eBay or FragranceNet. Now, I might I do have some things I want to get from FragranceNet, but it'll be a while because after I saw what's going on, and I'm serious. That there, and the reason I can say this, and I know what I'm talking about, because when I used to work at J.C. um, I worked in customer service. So I was, uh, we were across from the people in the beauty salon, and then there was a photo booth next to us. And at the end of the day, the girls in the cosmetic had to pass by us to leave out, so the security guy, because he would check people's purses, and them girls had a bag like this. Maybe not as big, and it was loaded to the top. Now, that was back in the day. That was a couple of years back. And we were like, what's that? Oh, this is the samples. These are the stuff we have left over. These are the things that the, uh, whatever you call the people that come in, this is what they give us. So, yeah, that's why they ain't giving you. That's why they're not giving us any samples. Like I said, that one lady, and she had fixed her stuff up so nice. So, when I go back to... Macy's, I'm going to make sure I go to Miss Denise and buy from her. She had two little carded samples and a little cute little clear pouch. She gave me one and gave my niece one. And like I said, that was at least $40 because the Gucci Guilty Elixir on eBay, I saw some people selling it, trying to sell it. It's like $12. Okay, so enough of yapping. Dolce Rosa. nice this is romantic this is sweet this is feminine this is definitely a date night just a special occasion you can probably you know get away with it you know at office uh but this is definitely a special occasion um and it is a, a five and a half mark jacobs perfect this is the one that the young man gave me at um Kohl's or sephora today and also i didn't know that too that they don't carry Dior, Chanel, Tom Ford, and something else. And she didn't have the uh, Carolina Herrera glam. She had the Supreme and something else. But yes, yeah, so there's certain things they don't carry uh, at the um, Coles, the Sephora inside of Coles. Okay, so let's see. This is good too. Well, I say it's perfect. Um, I think it to me. I I I want to say it might be better than some of his other fragrances. I do have a couple of Marc Jacobs. I gave two of them, uh, two full bottles to my uh, nieces because I had picked them up, got them really cheap at Ross two years back. Okay, moving on. Gucci Flora. I don't know if I'm saying it right yet. Gucci Flora. And this is Gorgeous Magnolia. Now, my niece tried the Gorgeous Gardenia on yesterday while we were trying on the elixir, the uh, Gucci Guilty Elixir. And she said right off the bat she didn't like the Gardenia. But I, I've already tried this Magnolia, and I was pleased with it. I did try the Gardenia at the store yesterday, and it was so-so. I was kind of surprised because I love Gardenias. Okay, so let's see Magnolia. Yes, it's good. Um, is it better than the Gardenia? I would say a tad better. Yeah, I would give this a four. The Gardenia, I don't know what was, I don't know what was it about the Gardenia. Okay, moving on. Uh, this is definitely from eBay. <laughs> and there's, and I didn't pay 20 some dollars for it. I don't know how much. I think I got it with something else. It was like right at, maybe right at about ten dollars this is coco noir wait a minute wait a minute no no this here i ordered something and i got this yeah but it wasn't from ebay this is coco noir chanel i saw that stuff on ebay i'm like uh-uh i'm not spending twenty some dollars and getting back to some of these uh, decant places, you guys, 
you can't get you can't find Chanel on uh I didn't, didn't see it on perfume core scent split of course not on lucky scent uh fragrance line I don't I didn't see it on those places if y'all know uh somewhere other than uh eBay please do share okay so I have two okay so let me goodness good 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 i think the one of the reasons why i never mess with i shouldn't say mess i never delve into chanel of course we didn't buy chanel uh my mom she was an sd lauder person uh is that chanel is very expensive and also Chanel is looked at, I was looking at some comments from people on Reddit in another place, and it has a reputation in people's mind as an old woman's fragrance, an old rich woman fragrance, grandma-ish type. And that's probably what I've always thought. That's probably why they're using a Natalie Portman for those Chanel um, uh, Mademoiselle commercials because that's what you think. That's what I always thought growing up, that that was an older woman, an old woman uh, fragrance. Okay, so moving on. Victor Rolf, uh Nectar. You guys, I got this one, I believe, at Kohl's. And guess what I did, you guys? I took my Sephora empty um, vial, and instead of me put it on this i was like you know what i'm gonna just put my make my own sample up now i think i did this yes yeah, sephora yeah so okay don't tell them i did that <laughs> again you can't go wrong with victor roth you can't flower bomb which is the best between the nectar and the ruby and the original, these are my last two, so I'm gonna do this. Um, I guess I'm partial. Uh, I will say the original and that new one, Tiger Lily, is like it's the bomb, you guys. <laughs> it's the bomb. Okay, the last one here is Dolce, uh, I did get Dolce Gardenia. You guys, yeah, so I got my own sample. I'm like, uh-uh, I'm not, y'all not putting this on no card for me. I'm not doing a card. I'm gonna get my little old used Sephora empty vial and I'm gonna make up my own sample. And I did it, yes. <laughs> so let's see. I'm not smelling gardenia, gardenia, because I told y'all we had a um, neighbor. I think he had both, and it was lined up against the fence. I'm not smelling what I should be smelling. And like I we talked about, and other people are fussing and complaining, especially those people that spend $300, for bottles. And they get home and they wear it and they're like, mm, I'm not smelling anything or I, I sprayed it and it's gone in 30 minutes. I don't, I'm not smelling any gardenia. It's, you know, I would give this a three minus. Yeah, I would give it three minus you guys. Um, but these cards, you can, the best thing, get you a little cotton swab, drench it down. <laughs> Spray your little wig. This is my hair, but spray your little wig. I don't know. Or get this. Put it up in your bra or something. Uh, get your vow. I don't know. Don't don't fight them. Don't don't go gangsta on these people. They tell you you can't do it or they uh, get mad at you. But get a, a little small vow and put your little a little spray. It'll last you for a day or so. That way you can think about it. It can marinate on your skin and you'll be like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. But hey, you guys, do not fall asleep on Bath & Body because it is a to-go-to place. 
where the family can enjoy at a reasonable price. Well, should I say reasonable, you guys? You better have that Bath & Body discount card or get, get it on special because Bath & Body prices has gone up as well. So you guys, share with me, leave the comments. How did I do? Do you have any of these fragrances? Are you experiencing the same thing? Have you caught on? Have you seen what they're doing with the cards that we used to get for free and nobody is giving them? Uh, which is your favorite? Do you have any of these? Uh, and hey, again, if you cannot buy a fragrance, if you cannot buy a perfume, you can do something. If it's just making a card for your honey, bake a cake, make him his favorite dinner, make her her favorite dinner, do a barbecue, get on the phone, <laughs> text a message, I don't know, draw a picture, paint a picture. You can do something. Better yet, maybe even get a puppy. You guys have a great, wonderful, sexy, hot, happy Valentine's, safe Valentine's Day. And thank you for joining me at What Else Maria Loves to Talk. Thank you.